What's up guys? It's Baby Hey and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, hi, I'm Haley and I'm so happy to have you here today. I'm filming a weekend vlog. It is Friday and I'm just gonna bring you along for what I'm doing this weekend. But got my new set on. I still need to cut the tags off. I literally just put this on but it's Friday. I'm feeling so good. I'm going to go down, do a workout this morning, get that out of the way. And I wanted to wear my new set. So first things first today is we're going to go do an upper body workout. <laughs> My eggs did not turn out very aesthetic today. I tried to crack them on the pan and they kind of cracked on top of each other, but that's okay. Put some EBTB on there and then I also made some oatmeal with a tablespoon of peanut butter. My alterations are ready to be picked up. Well, not all of them two of the pants and I want to wear one of them tonight. I'm going to this like event thing with Caitlin. So I need to go pick those up. They're all steamed nice so I'm excited to try them on. I'm going to this influencer event tonight with Caitlin at Jing in downtown Summerlin and I wanted to wear one of the pants to the event. I brought seven things to get altered but they were only done with two of the pants and so it worked out perfectly because I'll come back and get the other stuff another day but I just want to wear one of those and so I am going to go to that tonight. I think we're leaving or we're going to go like from 7 to 9. So I'm going to go home and then I'm going to shower and like get ready in a little bit. I'm just finishing up getting ready, but I wanted to mention that this video is sponsored by Daniel Wellington. I got my watch in from them and it is so beautiful. I love the angular shape of this. It's part of their new Quadro collection. And the one that I got is in the pressed mesh, the rose gold. And I love how dainty this is and petite. It's very trendy right now. And they also have the pressed mesh in a silver finish and black finish. And then they have different dial options. So there's white, black, or emerald. And then you can also get the band in pressed leather. So there are a lot of different styles to choose from. But I just really love the shape of this and how like classy it looks. I know that it's going to be super cute with my outfit tonight, so I'm very excited to wear it. But if you guys are wanting to shop anything, you guys can click the link in my description box and then use the code BABYHEY at checkout to get 15% off of your order. But thank you so much, Daniel Wellington, for sponsoring and sending me this beautiful piece. 
Here is the OOTD for tonight. I am wearing what I call my groovy top <laughs> that I got from Princess Polly, but I love the pattern in this and I just love the style of it with it being like open in the back and then ties. I think it's so cute. And then these are the pants that I also got from Princess Polly. I'm so glad that I got them hemmed because now they're perfect with like heels. And then I also got the length short enough so that I could wear them with sneakers. But I just went with black shoes and a black bag to match. And I think it's just like a really cute, like comfy, but like elevated outfit. And I'm going to be meeting Caitlin there because she's going straight from work. So we are going to be heading out now. like matching <laughs> literally matching didn't even plan it <laughs> our outfit our vibes are like the same yeah like we're both we're using a black heels, purse too gucci gucci girls <laughs> we're gonna take some pictures right now i mean i don't really want to use like shake shack but uh, maybe shake shack is not in it yeah maybe Let's try standing is here. it gonna be too like i don't know i'll tell you in a second Yeah, it's too like speckly. Yeah. Should we go farther down? Yeah. Mm. That's like too small. Mm -hmm. Oh, this isn't it? Try it. Maybe. Maybe. Um, I don't think the lighting is good. Honestly, I think we need to be in the shade. Really. Let me see it. Yeah, I want like sunshade though, you know? Mm -hmm. I want the sushi dinner light. I know, that was good. Just took the pictures in front of West Elm. <laughs> How to make it work. <laughs> Trying to get the shot. We took mine. We're gonna go take Caitlin's now. We'll see if I find a spot. I know, so. we will. I know, me too. I didn't eat dinner. Me either. <laughs> that we don't know. <laughs> it, I felt a little bamboozled. I felt so awkward. And But I mean, the whole dinner was free. It, it turned out to be really nice because the people were really yeah, nice. Yeah, they were so nice. The food was amazing and but, they brought us so many things. Literally, but I'm like, what? Wait, also, okay, my car is a mess. Okay, I parked so far away, so I'm making Caitlin drive me. No, to my car. No, it's fine. I can just sit with my feet up. Are you sure? Literally, it's like two seconds. Okay. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> this is where I sat on the way back from California, throwing trash on the floor. Oh, it's fine. I have my feet up. I mean, it's it's nice and warm in here. Oh, that was such a 
got in my pants. I know jeans after eating <sighs> and drinking. It's a no go. Literally. <laughs> I don't know, Haley. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, I'm about to make some coffee. I'm not having both of these. <laughs> I just took them both out because this one is like almost empty. And I went to Target on my way home yesterday. I just picked up more of the medium roast iced coffee because they were out of the Stoke one. And then I got oat milk, but this morning I'm just in the mood to have some of this almond milk and if you've never seen the milk brand before i just really like it because it has such minimal ingredients there's only filtered water organic sprouted almonds vanilla from vanilla beans and then himalayan salt but there's like no gums no dairy um it's all just like really clean obviously it's no dairy there's it's freaking almond milk <laughs> Sorry, it's early. I just woke up, but I am gonna make my coffee. I can't remember if the almond milk froths very good, so we'll have to see. But this milk frother changes the game. Like, literally, it makes such a difference for making coffee at home. I used to want to go to Starbucks like all the time, but once I got this, I felt like I was making my own like Starbucks yummy drinks by myself. So, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it literally just turned on hot. Oh my gosh, what is happening? Oh my gosh, you guys, what? There we go. <laughs> Why was I struggling so bad? I'm like talking about how great it is and then it's like not even working. Not as foamy as the oat milk, but I think it still turned out pretty good. Last night was so interesting <laughs> the event was like not what we expected that we were doing but it was still like really fun to go and like get pictures and hang out for a bit it was just funny because it was more of like a dinner and we thought that it was going to be like an event where there was going to be people walking around but it was just like we basically got invited to someone's like dinner over email <laughs> and they said it was an influencer event I don't know very interesting but then I came home and I talked to my grandma and it was literally so funny to be honest with you guys like sometimes I'm not in the mood to call her and I'm not trying to be mean at all it's just that I talk to her every single day around 7 p.m. and I love my grandma so much but I was so tired last night and I was like oh I'm not gonna call I'm gonna touch base in the morning and then ended up calling her and this like shower cap effect popped up on the screen and we were like crying laughing and it was just so funny but if you guys aren't aware of this I guess I can give you the backstory I posted on Instagram but so my grandma had a stroke when my mom was three years old and basically she had a brain aneurysm that burst which left her with paralysis on the right side of her body so she's like paralyzed and she can't read or write the stroke like caused her the inability of reading and writing and so when the pandemic first started last year i thought that she was probably super lonely because like can you imagine being in a pandemic and not even being able to read or write? 
and then having no visitors so i just offered to read this alcoholics anonymous book to her every night it's her favorite book and there's like a message for each day meditation for each day prayer for each day in it so i just suggested that i could read it to her every day and sometimes it's just a lot it's like hard to fit into my schedule because i'm really busy but i really do try my best i'm not saying that I make it every single night like there are nights that I haven't been able to in the past year but for the most part I really do talk to her every day and last night it was like 10 ish and I was so tired and I was like oh I'm just gonna go to bed but I texted my mom and was like do you think she's awake and my mom was like yeah and I was like oh okay I'll call her and then it ended up being so funny and we were just like dying laughing so it was just like that moment that reminded me why i call her every day and like why i do that and it was like something that i even needed so it was just really sweet but now i got my coffee and i like the almond milk but the oat one is still better it really is <laughs> I got an email yesterday from Aritzia. Do you guys remember? So I ordered the Aritzia leather pants and then I sent them back. And for the most part, I had ordered everything right away and like didn't wait for the refunds. But with Aritzia, I realized that I shipped the pants back 14 days after I had gotten them and aritzia only does full refunds within 14 days so they sent me like a merchandise e-gift card so i wasn't able to reorder them because i had to wait for the gift card to come because i didn't want to get a gift card after so anyways they sent me the gift card yesterday so i want to go reorder those pants in it too and then see if that size is better for me. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm also gonna do some editing this morning. It's Saturday, and I don't really know what else I'm doing today. <laughs> the almond milk is so good in smoothies, but you cannot top the oat milk in coffee, and I just really wanted oat milk. This is my excuse to have a second coffee. <laughs> so I made another. And then I got my breakfast. Feels so good out here. I have this like mark. I guess you, is it a mark? Like yeah, a mark under my lip. And well it's because, so Caitlin dermaplaned me on Thursday or Wednesday, whatever day it was and did like extractions and then I picked at it and so it left kind of like a little mark right here but I need it to heal. I do that every so often where I like pick at my face and I'm like oh why did I do that? So if you're wondering if you're like girl what's on your face? <laughs> that. <laughs> but it has been like kind of gloomy or like muggy the last few days in Vegas like earlier in the week but today it's like really sunny clear skies and it feels so good so i might go lay out by the pool i like to like do it on the weekends but it's 97 right now it feels so good and so i think i might go down there i got a pr package in the mail from stronger and i have been Meaning to open this. I'm excited to see what they sent me. But I got a new like sports bra like type top and I love the color of this. It's simply taupe. And then These are the 
pants. Got some leggings to match. So cute. The material is so good. It's like so thick. And then I got another set. Cute. These are some biker shorts. I love the detailing in the thigh. Also love this color. I'm so into neutrals. You guys know that. And then this is same style, same style top, but just in a different color. So here you guys can see the difference of like the shades, but I really love both. Cannot wait to try that on. And then I got one other like set, a long sleeve like sweatshirt, which is really cute. And then it has these like ties on the front it's so soft and then lastly some matching pants and these are so cute they are flare at the bottom which I think is going to be adorable so I need to try all this on but thank you so much stronger for sending me this package can we just take a moment for this lounge set i am obsessed with this you guys so comfortable and flattering i literally want this in like every color i'm not even kidding <laughs> so cute oh my gosh I got the top and bottoms both in an extra small, but wow, love. I'm in the middle of making some oatmeal, but I wanted to show you guys my pool look. I'm gonna be heading down, and I just have on this bikini from White Fox, and I just love the style of this. I think it's super flattering. The top is in an extra small, and then the bottoms are in a small. But I love this pink color, and I just really like the way that their bikinis fit me right now. I just like the style of it, and I'm honestly just like debating ordering a couple more. But I just threw on this little like sarong. It's from Topshop. I got it at Nordstrom a couple years ago. Honestly, it's like pretty old, but there are a ton of like sarong beach covers out there, so I'll try to link something similar. And then I have on this hat. It's from Amazon, but my old Paychex manager, she actually made it for me. She did a little like DIY with like a Chanel logo on it. And it's super cute. And then I just have on my sandals from Princess Polly. It is currently 102. And it's so bright, just like hot. But I forgot to mention this earlier. Well, it was because I went down to the gym and I forgot to bring my camera. But I just did 20 minutes on the Stairmaster. I don't know why I just was feeling Stairmaster today. And I was gonna do 30 minutes, but honestly I was dying, it was so hard. So I did 20 minutes on that. And then I did 20 minutes on the treadmill. So I did like 40 minute cardio session. And then my arm is like getting tired. I'm like shaking. Um, and then I went up, rinsed off in the shower, and then that's when I got ready for the pool. But I'm just gonna lay out and tan. I need to reapply my sunscreen. I put my sun bum sunscreen on like every morning because I like to sit out on my balcony. But I obviously need to re apply that <laughs> look who it is <laughs> 
Are you gonna get out? Huh? Are you gonna get out? Haley's coming to the gym and she's gonna vlog it. <laughs> the kicker ass. Show us the outfit today. Fit? The fit. I love it. 10 out of 10. Thanks. Especially the body. <laughs> and the face. <laughs> I just freshened up and kind of got ready but as you guys heard Brandon said that we are going to the gym together and just so you guys know I am gonna do a story time about this but we did not meet at the gym we have actually never worked out together this will be our first workout <laughs> and I'm honestly so nervous He's a bodybuilder and a trainer and is like a professional at this and I like don't know what I'm doing compared to him. <laughs> so I'm like internally freaking out right now. But it's gonna be good. He's gonna train me. I'm just wearing my light gray gym shark set and I was gonna wear my new light purple one but there is literally a hole in the long sleeve. I'm like, what the heck? So, just decided to go with the gray today. And this one is super cute. Got my little backpack. I just put like my tripod, phone, keys, all that in there. Huh? <laughs> is that what you're doing back there? Yeah. I didn't see your yeah. I know, I'm so sneaky. Welcome to my gym. Thanks for inviting me. Oh, no problem. I'm really nervous. Haley's gonna get huge. <laughs> You're gonna get huge. <laughs> Haley in her natural habitat. Hey, how you feeling? My legs are gone. <laughs> <laughs> Just <laughs> Show me how you deadlift. Guys, our form's actually good. So that's good, set it down, you're gonna hate me tomorrow. 10 out of 10. <laughs> okay guys, he's the real pro. <laughs> One day. No. How heavy is this? 315. Oh my gosh. Oh my quad is coming today. <laughs> <Okay>. <sighs> it's good. It was good. You're good. You can rest. Easy money. Good shit, girl. <laughs> He's making me squat. <laughs> oh my god. Are you sure you don't just want to squat? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I think so. We'll see. <laughs> Show me how you squat. Show me how you think you're supposed to squat and then I'll, and then I'll tweak you from there. No, you need to Okay, you're gonna put the bar on your back. <laughs> Total sarcasm. Okay, ready? Here, wait, rack it really quick. Okay, so step out real quick. Make sure your hands are even. So place your hands even on the bar. And then get under the bar and put it on your back. Like just on your neck, there you go. A little bit lower. All right, now take a little wider step. There you go, now point your toes out. Now your weight's gonna go on your heels and then hinge your hips backwards and squat all the way down. There you go. And then force your knees out when you go down. Good. It's basically a professional. 
go three more. This right here is what we call buckets. Buckets. Just start yelling it. Give me one more. Buckets. <laughs> Not bad. That was good. How do you feel? Yeah? How did <laughs> you said thanks? How was your first time squatting? It's good. It's a little hard. Okay, so let's put a couple more pounds on that bar, huh? Final set. Huh? At least 20. Six. This girl doesn't even need to work out. She's got a crazy body. Easy money. Okay guys, like this video if you think Haley should be an Olympic squatter. <laughs> She's going to the Olympics. <laughs> that was good. I can't what this? Why not? Because it's embarrassing. You'll be fine. Come on. Alright, Haley's gonna do a hamstring curl, guys. Oh, that's my bad. It's set for a giant. If you guys didn't know, Haley's 4'2. <laughs> Sorry, we can't hear you. What'd you say? <laughs> she does Brandon is 6'1. Okay. Let's go. One more. All right, I'll get little baby ones from the bottom. One more. Easy. None of that I can't shit up in here, all right? <laughs> so bad. That was good. She's doing so good. Guys, why is he so good? That was good. I'm out here. See, this is why uh, they call you arms. <laughs> you wanna go more or no? Yeah, yeah that's fine. not I'm even like a question. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I wanna go like... one more. <laughs> My God, those calves are ridiculous. They're so buff. <laughs> Tell me what you're doing. Absolutely. Straight legs, straight feet, toes out, toes in. <laughs> We're at Teriyaki Madness for dinner. Chicken and rice. Your favorite. Haley's officially a bodybuilder. <laughs> it's not oatmeal, but it'll do. <laughs> that is my favorite. <laughs> you guys, the day continues. <laughs> We're going to a movie now in our gym Haley clothes. Decided, Haley decided to literally bring me to the gym tonight and then to eat chicken and rice. <laughs> And then to bring me to a movie. Like, I feel like she stereotyped me, and I'm kind of offended. <laughs> this is your idea. Oh, really? Yes. You're gonna lie to all these people like that? <laughs> no, you wanted to. <laughs> Unbelievable. Just when you think you know somebody, huh? <laughs> We're gonna see Wrath of Man. He couldn't even remember the name of the movie. <laughs> Look good. It does. We'll see. Angle ever. <laughs> I think it's quite flattering. No, it gives me double chin. Let me see. I don't like that at all. <laughs> this is like the shittiest casino possible. It's awful. I promise I'll do better next time. I'm sorry, vlog. It's a Saturday night. Look at this place. It's dead. <laughs> I hope we're the only ones again. What's that? I hope we're the only ones again.
my legs are destroyed this morning. <laughs> I'm not even kidding you guys. They hurt so bad. I am so sore. I feel like I can't even walk. But Brandon said the best thing that I can do for myself today is cardio. So I have to go walk on the treadmill. That is on the agenda. <laughs> Oh, they just really hurt. But it's like in a good way, obviously. I'm trying to make gains. <sighs> I told them I could probably only handle like weekly sessions, like once a week training together because it hurts. And it was a light day for him. Like he wasn't even doing a hard workout. I'm like, that was so hard. <laughs> but it was just such a fun day yesterday. We literally spent the whole day together and it went by in a blink. Like, I'm like, how is the day already over? <laughs> we ended up seeing Wrath of Man and it's just like super suspenseful and there's a lot of action in it. But if you guys are wanting to go see a movie, I would recommend that one. I really liked it and he liked it too. He gave it a seven out of 10 rating, if that helps. But yeah, yesterday was just such a fun day. He's literally so cute. I'm not even kidding, I'm just like smiling. It's 9.32 right now and I went to bed so late last night. Like the last time I checked the time was 3.38 in the morning. I'm like, oh my gosh. And then I set my alarm for nine and I woke up at 8.58, like right before my alarm. So I thought I was gonna be like snoozing it and I woke up before and I was just like, I'm ready to go. <laughs> so I got up. Here we are, I'm gonna do some editing and then walk on the treadmill cause apparently I have to do that today. <laughs> and then maybe I'll like go lay by the pool or something. I think it's just gonna be a relaxing day today because yeah, my legs are killing me. I don't know how. But I made it. And I am so done. <sighs> I was really craving this. I am exhausted today. <laughs> oh, my legs are dying. <laughs> I did not even make it down to the pool. I wasn't really in the mood for that, but it has been so nice just relaxing today and doing a lot of editing. I'm currently watching Keaton's new vlog, and then after I finish this, I'll probably watch some Virgin River because I have a couple episodes left before I finish the season so that is pretty much the plan for this evening but it's been such a fun weekend like yesterday was the best day and I'm glad you guys got to come along hang out with me and Brandon a little more <laughs> He is so sweet, but you guys, I honestly think I'm just going to close out the vlog right here <laughs> because I'm just going to be in this same spot for the rest of the night. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> so I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Bye.